It's Sunday morning after the day-long fire that destroyed about a half block of this historic section of Makokita. Um, firefighters were called a little after 2 a.m. Saturday morning. They called in up to 24 fire departments from around the area, and some of them didn't leave till 5 a.m. Sunday morning. They eventually had to bring in a backhoe, firefighters said, to knock down the building because they couldn't fight it. It was too cold. And the roofs had fallen fallen down on floors below, creating kind of a layered effect, making it difficult to fight the fire. Get in there. Um, they said it was so cold that the off spray from the hoses would freeze before it hit the ground. One firefighter said it was like mini icicles hitting you in the face. They were working in crews of three on a 15 minute cycle. Working out of warming stations at a cafe. And this place right here, financial services place right on Main Street. Makokota's fire department is all volunteer. Has about 30 members, and none of them got much sleep last night. Assistant Fire Chief, Assist Assistant Makokota Fire Chief Al Mohazen estimated that there were 200 firefighters here, something like 30 tankers, and as you can see, it's still smoking. It's mid morning on Sunday. This is Gazette reporter Adam Bells.